Hey guys, it's Alonius here. Welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video, we are going to be having a nostalgic look back at some of the very best EAFC 24 players. This is the team that I'm pretty much finishing the game on. I'll be honest, I didn't really get many of these. Um, I went on holiday with my family and my 15 year old brother, Zach. Shout out to you if you're watching the video. He played on my account a bit and yeah, packed Neymar. So that was pretty cool. I don't know if this was from an SBC or something that Adama tried, but he got some pretty good cards. Um, this is my account pretty much in the game. I am going to quickly go through some of the best players in the game, a bit of a look through. We'll just literally just stream through attackers, defenders, midfielders, and I'll talk about some of the ones that I absolutely love, some of the ones I used a lot. And yeah, there you go. It's just a bit of a look back on this year's game as we get ready for next year. Never used this loose here, but man alive, he'll be insane. Van Dyke, pretty much for me, the best defender this year. Rolfo, she had some really good cards. Calafiori, that man just drips aura, doesn't he? What a card that would be. I really liked Calafiori's tops card. Saliba was really good. I got his um, Premier League <coughs> Premier League tops. Grimaldo had some great cards this year. Araujo was really good. Didn't really use Captivir this year. Last year he was insane, though. Um, Alfonso David had some good ones. Company, I was not a fan of. I thought he looked great, but didn't play that well for me. Bastoni, I really liked his. Top's one of my favourite defenders this year. Never saw this Reese card, but he's got 99 shot power, yeah. Pretty nice card. I thought he's obviously just bring some absolutely insane cards out. Let's see if there's any particular standout. Reese James, I quite liked him this year. More that stood out. Nice one, Guff. Are you sick to death of getting out teamed on FC24? Want that God Squad you've always been dreaming of? Check out IGGM.com today. The best and most reliable place to get coins for your ultimate team. Use the link in the description and code Zell at checkout for a 5% discount. Check out IGGM.com today. That's a tops, right? Yeah, I like that tops card. Dear Carlos, never saw this one, but cool dear Carlos getting a good for his card. Kalulu, pretty crazy card. Cucurella, Kujoro, so had a really good card there. Van de Ven, he'll be up there for one of the top start players. He's an 82, I think, but he's got 88 pace. He'll be outrageous at the start. So many cards now on the game, like pages of pages of 94s. So like 50 94 defenders or something stupid. Um Yeah, a lot of great cards. This Rio, this was a team of the year, Rio. Yeah, he was outrageous, one of the best cards in the game when he came out. I mean defenders, not particularly exciting, but a lot of great ones there. This isn't supposed to be like an exhaustive video, completely breaking down the matter of the best midfielders throughout the year. It was just a quick look. Um, yeah, it was just a quick look at some of the cards that I pretty much liked. Lam, that is a crazy card. Wow. Um, I really like Patelas Gold card, one of the best midfield, probably the best gold midfielder ever. I like Pedro's card this year. Sauer. I really like Sauer's normal icon at the start. Um, but then a team of the year upgrade barely felt like one. I used Erdegaard's SBC for a while. Vieira was really good this year. I know he's always good, but he was really, really good this year. Um, in the role he plays. Bon Matty was great. Modric had some really good cards. Jude was obviously great. He'll be fantastic at the start of 90. Snyder was cool. I liked him. Frink is always good. Great Crows flashback card. Park had some pretty good cards this year. Didn't like Oberdorf. She had a lot of high rate cards, but I wasn't really a fan of them, to be honest. So many, man. You have to tell me in the comments as well any cards that particularly stood out for you, any that you really liked. No wonder the market's so dead in terms of how cheap so many cars were. There's just so many insane options at this point. 
trying to think of some that really stuff me. I liked Zaya Emery. Wasn't uh, not this one. His tots. I really liked his tots when you evolved it a bit. Loftus Cheek had a really good one. Any cards I've got here that I liked? Verts. He was amazing as a midfielder or left back. Then forwards. We'll get to these, but there's going to be an insane amount of forwards. Sam Kerr quite liked. Morgan I really liked. Hansen. She was my first huge pull of the year. I got her. Um, was it Thunderstruck? Like the red promo, something like that. The Thunderstruck Hansen, really, really good card early on. Salah had some great ones. Ham was obviously a great addition. Harland, absolute beast. That's probably the best card of the game, this Harland. Um, Ronaldo, uh, I got his tops. That was really good. Neymar, uh, packed it really good. Ginola, always good. Great dynamic image on that and Kunku. Roy for beast as usual. Mbappe, always great. Probably be the best goal card again at launch. Saka got a great card there. Dalglish had some good ones. Lauren James at launch was really good. This top she got was great. Pop. Is it Alexandra Pop? Alexandra. Pop, she was great. Vanessa on the top. Some team of the year. I mean, Hullet always beast. I liked Booter at launch with uh, the technical. Playstyles really brought some players out of the shell this year. It's out of the shells if they were shy or something. So many cards I recognise. Fear Smith had some amazing cards. Liao. I loved Liao. I got his tops. Then at launch, he was amazing as well. Then Belly had a lot of cards. Super Ollie Watkins 5 5. Vinny was a beast. He'd be even more of a beast this year, being a 90. Chetri, shout out to my guy. Five star weak foot. This was like a 40k SBC during tops. He was crazy. Griezmann had some really good cards this year. How many cards have they released this year? Jeez. Been busy. Chewingu was a beast. Cover out was great. Cool dynamic of Oli. Jocelyn, man, when that came out, that was a nightmare card to play against. Uh, we must have had 100... 200 already that I've scrolled through. I feel like one that I really liked earlier on was named Diani. I think she was really good early on. Cardi was a pretty good one. It's too many to go through, to be honest. Um, see if there's any of that still in my club that I liked. Yeah, I had that Sophia Swift's good. Renard had some really good cards as well. Cole Palmer, I really liked that one. Uh, my Loftus Cheek. Slotback was a pretty good tops. I think there's any that I've kept in my club. I'll probably use them in SPCs. No, just so many cards to talk about, to be honest. Fair play to EA that the content team smashed it in terms of so many cards. I would say that they need to make cards a bit more accessible, a bit more easy to afford, rather than like last month for the game. But there you go. I appreciate you all tuning in. Hopefully this video has been fun for you. Let me know some of the cards you loved. As always, keep it spicy. I do hope to see you in the videos leading up to the game. And then there will be a lot more coming out launch. Peace.